Zucchini lasagna. Eat delicious and lose weight with Chef Pachi. Zucchini lasagna. An amazing meal for an evening or any time of the day. So the first thing we do is we're going to make our filling. And it is half a cup of ricotta, one cup of Greek yogurt, a tablespoon of roasted garlic, and one cup of roasted tomatoes. And the, both the garlic and the tomatoes, the links to the recipes will be in the bottom. Half a teaspoon of salt, quarter teaspoon of pepper, and one egg. And look at this beautiful, beautiful sauce that does not have to be cooked or anything filled with flavors. Imagine the roasted tomatoes and the garlic and oh, it's amazing. And that ricotta cheese. So then we put our lasagna together and all we have to do is take our zucchini that we baked and you've seen the video, but at the end I'll have it again. Place it on an oiled baking pan, add some of this delicious sauce, then another time zucchini, then again the sauce, then again we do another layer of zucchini, another layer of ricotta, and same until we finish with all of them. It's about three layers of ricotta mix and four layers of zucchini. We use three large zucchini to get this amount of roasted zucchini, and I use two baking pans. You'll see at the end of the video how we make them in case you haven't seen it in our previous videos of how to roast zucchini. So here we go, we cover and finish our delicious lasagna. Now we add just a little bit of sauce so that it ties up together the zucchini and there we're gonna put a little sprinkle of parmesan. If you want to add parmesan inside, you can. I didn't because I didn't think it needed, but you can. It's perfectly well. We're gonna place the last of the layers of the zucchini and on top of it, we place some parmesan. Now you can refrigerate it and keep it in your fridge until you're ready to bake it. You can actually refrigerate it until the next day. And they just bake it at 375 degrees for about 20 to 25 minutes. All you're doing is cooking that egg, heating up your lasagna, and you're ready to go. Look at that beauty coming out. It is delicious, the aroma. Those zucchini I had cooked with oregano. You can cook your zucchini with any herb you want. Delicious food, amazing food. Enjoy, Chef Pachi. Following, we're going to teach you again how to make all these easy and delicious sliced and roasted zucchini. So the first thing we want is to get a zucchini that is pretty firm. We wash our zucchini and we're going to slice them. And the easiest way to do it is on the mandolin because we're going to slice them about an eighth of an inch. We want them thin, not paper thin because then they become too, too crispy but very thin, and we're gonna bake them at the oven. We're gonna add a little bit of salt and pepper, a little bit of olive oil, and mix them. The three dried herbs that I like the best with my zucchini are oregano, thyme, and rosemary. So we're gonna organize our zucchini in a baking pan over a piece of parchment paper, and then at the end, we're gonna just add a dash of olive oil on top of those dried herbs. That's it, slice, spice, and bake. We're gonna bake it for 25 minutes at 375 convection. Let's check them out. If they're not ready, then put them back in for another 10 minutes because they are full of water and you're gonna need to have all that water evaporate. Remember, with Chef Pachi, delicious food, amazing food. Enjoy, Chef Pachi. Subscribe and turn on the bell for recipe updates.